It's already midsummer hot before the season has officially started. Uh, it's been pretty, pretty hot. Nonstop filling up the water, going in the pool. For millions of Americans, temperatures have soared from the uncomfortable to the unbearable. This season, this summer is honestly to be one of the worst I've ever experienced. In California's Death Valley, the mercury approached 50 degrees Celsius. In Arizona, doctors have warned that touching a sun-baked doorknob or car handle could cause severe burns. Anyone in the city who's working outdoors, not in a climate controlled environment, is absolutely at risk for heat stroke or heat exhaustion. That over there used to be islands. The extreme heat comes at a time of severe drought. California's Lake Mendocino has become a desert. A problem because the water is an important source for firefighting planes and helicopters to airdrop. We need water to survive and it's scary. It really is. Firefighters are already training for what's expected to be another record-setting fire season. They're practicing their craft in these extreme conditions. They work 24-hour shifts, so it is imperative for them to be acclimated to this. Scientists see something more alarming than just another heat wave. They warn this is the consequence of climate change. These heat waves are going to be more common, more intense, and more devastating. Already, residents in California and Texas have been warned the power grid is at its limits. They've been told to conserve or face potential blackouts. This western state heat dome is a dramatic reminder that Mother Nature bats last and she bats a thousand. A preview of what could be a long, hot summer. Jackson Prosco, Global News, Washington.